Hi, I'm Katie Ziskin from Wisdom Within Counseling. Hi, I'm Megan Rose from Wisdom Within Counseling. And Megan's going to share a little bit about teenagers with you today. So, you know, what are teens that might be challenged emotionally going through Megan? Teens that are challenged emotionally might be going through a disconnect, feeling at home or at school, just feeling like an outsider, feeling alone, just feeling like they don't fit in, feeling shut out from other people and that no one understands them. Yeah, it is. And sometimes teens feeling that way might be aggressive or self-harm or develop an eating disorder or just kind of almost uh, anxiety, like perfectionism. Yeah. And like, you know, that's right. They mm -hmm. might start acting out upon themselves or others. The parents might notice that they start slamming doors, shutting themselves in the room. They might start going out later at night than usual or hanging out with a different crowd and might be the child that they come at, become a teen, somebody that they feel like they don't know anymore. Right, like they like their parents don't even know their child anymore. And the teen might not even know themselves anymore. They might not know themselves. And might be getting into substance use or alcoholism, and that might even run in the family. And you might want your teen to have positive coping strategies, you know, to kind of reduce those negative behaviors. We can definitely teach them some positive coping strategies, some ways to nurture themselves, because if you just do uh, self-medication in self-destructive ways, you might not be able to heal yourself through positive ways, but we can do coping skills, we can reduce anxiety, and find structure and balance in your life in healthy ways. Yes, yes, and like lifelong mechanisms, you know, therapy is such a cool relationship because you know, you can talk about those things that you might not be able to talk about in other areas of your life. Like, you know, with parents or with teachers, you know, this is a unique environment where you can express, you know, so let's talk about those creative expressive arts and the options that are holistic here that might be, you know, uh, perfect for a uh, anxious adolescent or a young adult with depression. We can look at different types of art. We can look at oil crayons, we can start to even try new things that I'm looking into, like maybe alcohol inks that are something new that I'm looking, willing to try. Acrylic um, paints. Acrylic paint, clay. glitter pens, different things like that. Drawing. Drawing. Yeah, sometimes teens need um, more than just traditional talking to express anxiety get out stress go for a walk get some fresh yeah, air walk, get walk the body talk. movement get your levels of serotonin going yeah yeah walk and talk therapy is a really unique thing and that's helpful for teens that might not want to make eye contact and need that side-by-side -side relationship or that even helps depression you know if a teen's right. having trouble getting going um so we really personalize therapy here with some within counseling and offer a mixture and a combination of art, yoga, music, outdoor sessions to build self-esteem tools, you know, strategies to manage anger, you know, kind of build meaningful relationships. You know, and the best way to get started with one of our therapists here, building emotional confidence tools you know, whether it's for your child, your teen, or for yourself, if you're in a marriage looking for counseling, you can book a free phone consultation at wisdomwithinct.com. That's wisdomwithinct.com. Have a great day.